Hi, I'm John Napolitano, the CEO of U.S. Wealth Management. Believe it or not, the two most common occurrences in people's lives that cause them to get or update their wills are the birth of a child or a long trip. Whatever the reason, getting an estate planned is amongst the most important issues you can resolve if you love those who will survive you. Having a valid will eliminates guesswork and it prevents the state from stepping in under the laws of intestacy to decide what happens to your property when you pass. Now congratulations to you if you've recently updated your wills. For many, however, this update alone may still leave gaps in a rather costly and time-consuming estate settlement process. Many estates with wills only will undergo the probate process. That process, in essence, is the state or the court's supervision of the disposition of your estate and assets according to the terms of your will. That's a mouthful. For anyone who's been an executor or an executrix of an estate, you know what a hassle this process can be. In addition to the settlement process being drawn out and longer than it needs to be, an estate plan with simple wills may have other limitations that are important to you. A big one may be the ultimate distributions to your children. If you and your will, like many, leaves everything to a spouse with the remainder to your children equally, start praying now that your children don't ever get divorced, have health issues, or become substance abusers, get sued, or start a business that fails. Statistics show that many inheritances are squabbled away within a year or two because of excess spending or sloppy management of the inheritance. After all, if someone put a few hundred thousand in your pocket while you were suffering through final exams in college, would you even study or show up for the exam? Clearly, too much money in the hands of minors too soon can be just as damaging as it may be helpful. A solution may be to add trust to your estate plan. If your attorney tells you that you don't need trusts or that they've built them into your wills, don't settle for that. Ask about the costs and the time frame to ultimately settle that estate and then decide if that plan is still okay with you. If the idea doesn't resonate with your attorney, get a second opinion immediately.